A giant prehistoric shark remains a mystery, but it may have been even bigger and more terrifying than previously thought. That and a report at Study Finds, where we invite you to like and subscribe to get the latest information. The megalodon's actual size remains a mystery after 15 million years, but odds are no Sharknado can pick this baby up. Researchers from DePaul University in Chicago say every proposed image of the gigantic predator sits in the realm of fantasy. <laughs> the truth is, scientists are still trying to piece together what the beast looked like and how big it really was. Here's paleobiologist Kanushu Shimada from DePaul University holding a tooth of the nasty beastie, or the so-called meg or megatooth shark. Depends how well you know it, I guess, what you can call it. Recent estimates suggest the creature measured up to 65 feet in length and weighed more than 50 tons. However, since researchers have only found the shark's teeth and jaws, they can't determine definitively the beast's actual shape. Lead author Philip Stearns from the University of California, Riverside, said, quote, This new study shows that there are currently no scientific means to support or refute the accuracy of any of the previously published body forms of O. Megalodon. <laughs> are we sure this guy's not a lawyer? He sounds very lawyerly. The earliest fossils of Megalodon date back to over 20 million years ago. The enormous fish continued to dominate the oceans until going extinct about 3.6 million years ago. Its seven-inch teeth and the odd vertebrae here or there are all that remain. Cartilage rarely survives fossilization. Without a complete skeleton, reconstructions are only speculative. In fact, Megalodon translates to large tooth. I hope they don't just find me one day and call me Big Belly. Well, anyway... With its large serrated teeth, Megalodon likely dined on meat, including whales, large fish, and other sharks. Although some have suggested the Megalodon could still be alive today, the premise of the 2018 movie The Meg, experts say that it's impossible. That's crazy talk. A warm water species would not be able to survive in the cold waters of the deep. The jury's still out on the Loch Ness Monster, Bigfoot, and Chupacabra. Find more detail on this and other studies at studyfinds.com.